Hey, is it selling? What she doing over there? Let's take a look. Hey, Xiaoling, what are you doing? Hey, I'm looking for the snail. Look, over there. So Xiaoling and Wan Jing will explain what is a snail is. Let's check it out. What is snail? Snail is the one of the earliest known type of animals in the world. It means that they lived nearly 500 million years ago. They always carry their home, which is a sparrow shell or their back. It will protect their soft body and internal organs. Snails do not have legs. So, they are called moats. The habitats of snail, which are under a stone, climbing on a leaf. You can find anywhere include deserts. They are using their sense of smell to help them to find a food. There are different types of snail. There are some examples of snail. Katina Katina is a gentle giant African land snail. They can grow to 38 cm and weigh 1 kg. Next is Cerex aerorunners. It is a sea snail. It can grow up to 90 cm and weight can go up to 19 kg. Wow, it is amazing! Water Pagodula is a freshwater snail. The size average 3 until 5 cm. It has fine lines on the shell and a light brownish color of sloth. Did you know? Snail and humans are related. Let's find out. Last time, my friend went to a French bistro. She ordered a dish called Escango de Bourgogne. The snails are baked with herbal garlic butter with some parsley. Many countries like to eat snails such as Indonesia, Vietnam, and China. Nowadays, many people like to keep snails as their pet. Yes, pet. 
You can search on YouTube. There are many types of video and they keep sneer as their pet. They share how to take care of their sneer. So then at night, I go into their enclosure. I will have to film this in the day so that I've still got light to be able to film it. But generally at night, I'll go into their enclosure. I will take all of their decorations out. I'll spray them down and then I will check through the soil, turn the soil over just to make sure that that soil has been rotated. It's been aerated. It's And I also check for eggs at this point. Now I'll have moved all the snails out to the side just for the moment and then what I can do next as I put them back in is I can spray them down, check them over, make sure there's no parasites on them and that their shell is all perfect and then I pop them back into their home. Next of all I put all of their decorations back in, they have different types of foliage to hide under uh, just for a bit of enrichment, snails aren't really aware of any kind of other kind of enrichment, just environmental things like that is enough to keep them stimulated and entertained. So last of all, I put their food in so that they can dig right in and enjoy whatever meal I've prepared that day. So in terms of food, the options are vegetables and the occasional fruit, although the fruit do go disgusting so you have to take that out in the morning if you do give them fruit because vegetables tend to last just a bit longer. I give them fish flakes for a protein source once a week. I also give them snail mix which matches more closely their diet. Their diet is optimum about 20% protein and 10% fibre. Now. Vegetables are low in protein and high in fibre, so vegetables, just personally for me, don't quite cut it, so I like to feed them a snail mix just to make sure that they're getting the optimum amount of nutrition. But vegetables are still important for their vitamins and minerals. So today I'm going to give the snail some baby carrot. Um, it's just very small and we had these for Christmas, so. Uh, we've also got some turnip that's left over from Christmas and a spring green, which they'll enjoy. And I'm just going to put this in. Excuse me, everyone. <laughs> I'm going to put this straight down here. If I go on top of any snails, it doesn't matter. They'll um, move out of the way. Uh, Even find a partner for their snail. Long time ago, there were many country tax near as folk roll. The most popular folk roll is Kyong, a must which comes from Indonesia. So, there are the characteristics of snail. I am Wang Jing, stay well with us. We will see you on the next adventures.